Hi students, um, Dr. Newmark here. Okay, so we are headed into week 15. This is the second to last week of the semester before finals week. Um, you might be getting tired of these little chatty videos from me, but I just want to reach out to you somehow um, beyond the course videos that are about a specific assignment and beyond just sort of alphabetic text in an email, which can sometimes seem impersonal and you might not be able to get the emotional flavor that I am sending out to you in an email like uh, I've been sending. So the purpose of this uh, video is just to say um, in these last two weeks as you're pulling together your portfolio, please feel very encouraged by me to reach out. I'm happy to work with you on refining that portfolio, on making sure you have all of the components pulled together. Um, I'm happy to answer any questions you might have about the resume component, the bio statement component, or the reflection. As I've mentioned in the course itself, the reflection is very crucial. It provides you an opportunity to reflect on everything you've learned this semester and knit it all together. You're looking at your learning through the lens of the student learning outcomes but you're also thinking about how your learning pertains to other classes in which you may have been enrolled and your future workplace goals or your current uh, work life or your historical work life, I should say. So um, there's a lot to do in the reflection, but it's also a space for you to kind of personally think about the challenges of this semester uniquely and think about your work in this class through that um, prism, I suppose. So this video um, that I'm sharing today is mostly just a check-in, just a human to human, how are you doing video. Um, but I also wanted to make a few points about the portfolio in it. Uh, this week, you need to continue working on the portfolio. As you can see in the updated course calendar on our Learn site, there's not a lot on there this week in terms of anything you have to deliver, so to speak. You need to work on the reflection, you need to work on the resume, you need to work on the bio statement, and work on making sure everything is in the portfolio where it needs to be. Anyway, I'll stop talking about that and just shift to, um, I hope you're doing okay, and if you have anything emerging in your life that is going to impact your ability to get your work done for this class, please communicate with me. Any challenges you're having that's that are impacting your school life overall, I'm happy to try to um, connect you to resources at UNM that can support your success. Um, I am continuing on my stay-at-home journey, as many of you are, but I know that many people have to go out into the world on a regular, if not daily, basis if they still have a job. Um, many people have to go to work. Many people in healthcare, all kinds of industries are working hard right now, and that's definitely hard to juggle with all the other shifting phenomena that we're facing. So I am thinking about all of you regarding whatever challenges you're facing. I know a lot of my students, uh, when the UNM dorms closed down, they had to move home. That created all kinds of upheavals and challenges. So whether your challenges are concerning health, whether your challenges are concerning your job, whether your challenges are concerning connectivity, or as I've heard some students say, there's just so much chaos in my house because all my siblings are home and my parents are home all the time and it's hard to get any work done. Um, or whether you live alone and it's hard just to kind of be alone all the time. I just want you to know that um, I, I can't do a lot more emotionally, I guess, I wish I could, than to say I'm here for you to listen. Um, I want you to know that though I am your professor, I am here to try to make your pathway towards success in our class and at UNM as, as feasible as possible. And if there's anything I can do to help you, please let me know. And I love receiving your messages and your emails. So keep in touch with me. We're in this for a few more weeks together. And um, I look forward to communicating with you more. And I'll send you another silly little video like this next week. Bye.